This is the Science for Life laboratory where we have created an infrastructure for technology-driven research in medicine and biology. That life science research has become very complex. You need to attack the problems with multi-disciplines. It's great that you bring people together from different angles, let's say Karolinska with more like a medical focus, like uh, Stockholm University with more biological focus and KTH with a technology focus. To try to create something which is above what you usually see in the research environment at the university. Our aim is to strengthen life science within Sweden and that is both for academia and also for, for the industry. We are looking for problem formulation that we could solve the academia and the industry together. The vision is to make SciLife Lab one of the leading centers for large-scale biosciences in the world. Looking at the Stockholm Uppsala region, we have really come far. And we have the unique resources to reach our goal. We have the, the high-quality biobanks, we have the patient registries, we have the antibodies from the Human Protein Atlas project that is conducted here, and we are developing very interesting uh, world-leading technologies within the center already. I think that we are living now in an, a, a very short time of, of history where you can do a lot of exciting things in biology and medicine using these new technologies which are being developed and that we are having this center. And a lot of researchers see that potential and are very excited now about the fact that we can now do this kind of analysis. Sometimes you can use the word next generation. I mean, we have a lot of people coming here and they all, uh, are overwhelmed, not only by the design, but also by the equipment that we have. So, and I think that is something that's probably unique. We have the instruments, we have the competences, and it's easy for the scientists to ask, uh, how can I uh, use your techniques to look at, at the solutions of my problem? SciLife Lab is based on a strategic research grant from the Swedish government. Actually the largest ever in Scandinavia in this area. And in this we see a huge interest from life science industry. We are collaborating with several companies on different levels. Uh, we have the companies providing state-of-the-art technologies. Uh, we have the companies using the services. And we have companies uh, collaborating with scientists at SciLife Lab in research programs. It's actually feel that this is building history. It's a bit much to say maybe, but it feels like people that never have met before, they are meeting now and they find that we have common interests, uh, we can do things together. So I feel this is, this is historical, I would say, being part of this.